it's very hard to please you. Isn't it? You're not breaking at all. We'll have to talk about that. If you get better, you become more fluent. No, no, Kira is too quick. Yeah, You're doing the boogie with the car. Good use of the left mirror there. Hi guys, it's Kira from Yanomize and we're back with Arif for lesson number six. Hi, my name is Arif, obviously you know by now from Get uh, Licensed Driving School. Um, Kieran, what we're going to do today, I've been thinking about it on the way here, um, your driving's getting a little bit, a lot better, a bit more confident. We're going to talk about um, awareness and anticipation and planning yeah. for the first part of the lesson. And if you feel comfortable, then what I really want to start on today is the uh, roundabouts as well. Although we've been through quite a few roundabouts, I've had to explain it to you quite easy because I haven't briefed you on it. Yeah. And hopefully we can cane it today. What have we covered? Taking off. Moving off, yeah, yeah. and stopping. Yeah, what else? point, hill starts. Okay. Turning. Turning left, right from major to minor, emerging at road junctions, turning left and right, yeah. Traffic. Meeting traffic. Okay. What are you happy about your driving? What does, what's the good points in your opinion? I don't know. There's no good points. Well, last lesson you were moving off a lot better. Yeah. You was looking ahead. You were changing gear a lot better. Yeah. Okay. Now, once we obviously have some control over the car. Yeah. We then got a master of what we call planning, observation, and awareness. Yeah. Let's oh. say planning. What do you think planning is? Thinking ahead. Good. Looking ahead, yeah. yeah. Planning what the road leads to. Yeah. The road signs, looking for the road signs, awareness, yeah. yeah. What the other driver's going to do. The further ahead you look, again, you've got plenty of time to deal with any situation that may arise. And the key word here is safely. Yeah. All right, to be able to stop safely it's like for instance let me give you a little example now yeah. we're driving down the road and i'm looking as far ahead of those lights yeah you see now obviously i can see a pedestrian crossing so what i've done is check my mirror off the gas now i'm ready for anybody here yeah i can see a young lady look at the way i'm approaching it checking my mirrors and stopping safely plenty of time yeah now before i move i'm just quick glance either way just to make sure it's all clear yeah see here these two ladies on the left may walk across the road obviously we've made eye contact you see eye contact is also very important look at them yeah and it almost tells you what they're going to do you see further ahead the lights i'm looking at the sign on the lights now because i want to plan where i've got to go and what's the sign telling me red Stop. what's the sign underneath it telling me left hand only yeah and this is how you do it and then you can adjust your speed your position on the road your mm. gears all right so once we start to obviously control the car and the controls a lot better, we've got to master looking ahead. Home sweet home. My favorite spot. Okay. Yep. Yep. You ready? Yep. One last thing, don't be intimidated by other drivers, okay? Yeah. I'll let the handbrake on. Okay, okay, we saw it out. See, and as you move off and straighten up, check your mirror just in case someone comes around a corner. And if they're catching you up, we can accelerate away, okay? Yeah. Good. You know those signs there on the left and right, they're all there to help you. Yeah. And triangular signs are mostly what? Warnings. Okay, so it's warning you that you're coming up to a giveaway. Yeah. You also might have a triangular paint at the junction which is also warning you and you've got warning lines in the middle of the road yeah with our long lines with short gaps they're warning lines okay so you've got quite a few signs there <coughs> telling you where what you're approaching so when you come to a pedestrian crossing like we spoke last week what should you do 
Look left and right and slow Or down. check your mirror, cover the brake. If your visibility is quite poor, yeah. check your mirror, cover the brake. So you've checked the mirror, yeah. you've covered the brake, you're ready, okay? But I want to see you react to this. I want yeah. to see you doing this. So your head, what can you see ahead? Man in the middle. Okay, so we don't know what he's doing, so we've got to be positive in what we're doing, okay? Kieran, I'd like you to look left as well, please. Yeah, you're looking right constantly. Just keep the head moving right left. Uh, get eye contact with the driver. He's obviously proceeding there. Don't force your way in. Be patient. Yeah, try not to force your way in. Be patient. It's his right of way, yeah? Mm. Try and get eye contact, because some of them let you out and some of them don't. Well done. Good. Now, if you can't, just pause here for me. Because if you can't clear the junction, we don't want to enter it. Okay. Now, because we're the leading car, yeah. always get ready a little bit earlier. You see the green light there? It's filtering you through. Can you see it? Yeah, let me nothing go. Yes. Okay. All right. Yeah. Carry on. Always be aware of the lights, it's filtering you. Because left only, do I still have to indicate? Yeah, you can do, but it's not, it's a left turn from this lane, but yeah. you can do for pedestrians, maybe cyclists as well, you can put your signal on, it's not wrong. Like you said earlier, yeah, yeah. you nearly panicked, but you didn't, whereas previous lessons you would have panicked. Yeah. And because I saw you deal with it, yeah. I kept quiet there because you're dealing with it. It was a bit quick off the clutch though, but... A bit quick? Yeah, just, you... just a fraction. But you did stall and you dealt with it. Well done. This right here, yeah. Yes, please. What are you looking at, the teacher or the pupils? Both. This is the issue you're going to cross, obviously not. Good, well keep. done, good. You made eye contact with her, didn't you? Yeah. To be honest with you, you would have turned and I said, did you see the kids? You would have said no. Because you're so concentrating on what you were doing in the car. Yeah. You know, but there you can, because you're more comfortable driving, yeah, you've yeah. got time to look around there and assess. No, I feel, I feel all right today. Yeah, you, you can't As in like, I don't feel scared. <clears throat> If you come across, next lesson, if you don't drive from the garage, yeah. me and you're going to have a little punch <laughs> Two little points there. Look at the way your clutch is still down. You see the clutch? Yeah, no, I, didn't feel be, it, but I didn't want to let go of it. Yeah, but you got to because then you coast in. Yeah, come off the clutch. So you come off the clutch. You change your gear reasonably well. Yeah. Then yeah, you come around a corner with a clutch down and you're not in control. Okay, off the clutch. See again here, you see what this guy is doing? Look. Yeah. You notice the amount of people that walk across the road without looking? Yeah. I know they have walked across to have looked. Uh, do we do it, I suppose? Do you do it? No, I normally, normally I look. Okay, see the e lorry? Yeah. <coughs> he could swing out a little bit, yeah? So you've yeah. got to take that into consideration. And when lorries are doing a manoeuvre, yeah. and you can see they're doing it, you've got to hold well back because they need a lot of room to yeah. do the manoeuvre. Okay, so and you don't want to muck about with lorries. Turn first left. Think about what you're doing. Good. 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 Off that clutch, keep breaking. <coughs> Check your left mirror. Maybe if it goes well, next is something we can talk about reversing. Start reverse, get rich starting on the parking and maneuvers. When we do that, do we actually reverse in between cars or two bins? Cars. Where are we going to find bins? <laughs> I don't know. You know, you see it in American shows, the American, the American movie, you've got the two bins. Yeah, all right, you get the bins and I'll find a place. Yeah? <laughs>
<laughs> two bins. And the examiner's going, going to go looking for two bins to get you to park. Right, a little bit more cash, please. Right, can you hear an emergency vehicle? Yeah. Yeah. Check your mirrors, please. Gently brake. Carry over here, please. Right. Right, check your mirrors, please. Okay. First gear, please. Right, just wait here now. Lights have changed. Okay. Yeah. Whenever you hear an emergency vehicle, first of all, identify which direction it's coming from. Mm. Check your mirrors and hopefully stop at a suitable place where he can carry on. Okay. Good. Mini roundabouts of which I want you to follow the road ahead. Okay, straight ahead. Okay. okay. See, do you think you need a signal on this one? No, no because you're straight. Yeah, so you're sort of misleading them, aren't you? Really. Start looking right to left. Okay, if you look at your mirror, what's behind you? A grey. And what do we have to be careful about him? Breaking. Good. Now you don't change gear with your eyes. Well, well, you know when the car was shaking, well, yeah. was, that, was that the gear? That or? was the road. I was going to say. It was the speed as yeah. well, but the, you know, the road gears here. It's all like speed carbers. At the roundabout, I'd like you to please turn left first exit. Doing a left, don't signal too early. All right. There's a little junction there before it. Get your position, get your position. Try not to look too much one way. See, when you approach that roundabout, okay, you were looking so much to the right, yeah. that your car's drifting over to the right there. Gotta look both ways, okay? Yeah. Alright. This lesson feels alright, you know? Huh? So this lesson feels alright. Yeah, I'm proud of you. I'm gonna give you two stars, three stars today. <laughs> Maybe four, but no, that's pushing it. Right, check your mirror, build it up now. Build it up. What's the speed of it here? 40. Yeah, build it up. Don't look at the gears, bro. Wait, don't look at the gears. Sorry, sorry. <laughs> These solid white lines in the middle of the road, what do they mean? Overtaking. Overtaking, crossing or stretching, okay. And fourth gear, please. Right, what can we anticipate on this type of road? There's a bend coming up. Wells. Wells? Yeah. Cyclists, sure. hikers, yeah. Animals and it's up the roof, horse riders. Yeah. yeah so think about those lights. Someone's pressed the wall, the way. Ooh. Now look at the road ahead. Good. I have to break that shaft. Oh, I forgot to put a clutch down. Yeah, I know. <laughs> I was just about to leave you to see what you're going to fix there, and then you did. Should I downshift again? I don't yeah. think about it first. Right. Yeah, instead of, put, yeah I was, instead of pressing the clutch, I just press the brake. Yeah, I thought we were braking a bit too much there. Second gear. Now you're coming a long way in first there, bro. Yeah, there, you could have got second before the turn. Yeah, I didn't know if you could... T Get second and then turn. Like, yeah, it, if it's, if you can do if second while turning, is that possible? Not while turning, but you have the chance to change your gear before you turn. Check your left mirror. Check your right mirror, please. Come on, this is where I want the mirror checked. Yeah. See how those guys have stopped for you here? Yeah. Yeah, see yeah. they're anticipating you and they're stopping. Slow it down a little bit just in case someone opens the door. Or... Mm. 
So you like me to turn right? A uh, second set of lights, yeah. Second set of lights. Off the clutch. Can I let go of it like that, but the car jolts? Yeah, not... but we'll come off a bit slower. You're coming off too quick, and then two plates are hitting, aren't they? Yeah. You know, no? Did your mum and dad try? Uh, my dad does, not my mum. You see what she did? Yeah, she went for the red light. She went for the red light. You see, you anticipated that, didn't you? No, because she, she saw that one too. I know, but you anticipated. You yeah. said that she's going to do that. Why are these reds for so long? I don't know. Be patient. You're turning right. Come on, a little bit of gas. Second gear on the straight bit. This is what I meant with the other lights, remember? Yeah. So you get in second gear before the turn. Some people are just impatient. Some lights here, be careful. What's the speed limit here? 40. Can we not make a bit more progress? No, I just wanted to go around that bend slow. Okay, got a bend, good. Now, some roundabouts, you know when I said to you, if we're going straight, we keep to the left at the roundabout? Yeah. But there's some roundabouts, because of the layout, yeah? Yeah. It would be best to go straight from the right-hand lane, because the fact that the left-hand lane's almost yeah. turning into the left, it would be, well, it would, it would have been right to go straight from that lane, okay? Because it's always bearing left. So we're coming up to a little roundabout here where that applies. Where the left hand lane's almost turning into the left. Yeah. So on that occasion, yeah, if you assess it, it would be more convenient to go straight from the right oh. hand lane, okay? We're coming up to that roundabout now. I'd like you to follow the road ahead. Second exit, please. Now have a look ahead to see who's going to block him off. See, there you could have gotten, yeah, see? Down. And there again. See, when he enters, there you go. All right, that's yeah. what we assess. Who's going to block off the car on the right so that I can enter? Yeah. Again, look here. Do you think that third gear is necessary on this uh, bit? Right. See, that shows me that you're not thinking before you change the gear. Yeah. So what you should have done there is Slow looked down, ahead. Yeah. No, looked ahead and said, right, I'm not going to get third bus coming towards me. Yeah? And then you wouldn't have got it. All right? Yeah. So think before you do it. Assess it before you do it. Alright, that's the first time I've had to stop you today. First yeah, he put it on so late. You doesn't matter. First gear, please. Now, he wasn't signalling left, was he? Left? He was. No, no. Right, so then where was he going? Even if he signalled late, yeah? Yeah. Now have a look left as well. Keep your head moving. That's the first mistake that you've done today. Well, I saw it. I was going to break anyway. Well, it was late. Look where I stopped you. Yeah, there's plenty of space. Look at the you see? You've entered. You've entered those lines, son. Have a look left as well. Oops. Okay, brake. Start your car. Yeah. Take your time because you've done really well today. Don't rush. See, they're turning left here. Okay. You know what happened there, son? I don't know. A bit rushed there, weren't you? Yeah. yeah. You must admit. Even though you, st you know, I stopped you, I we entered. Now, there, he weren't signalling left. He His had, position yeah. was straight, like he's going across. Yeah. He signalled, yeah, whether it was late or not, his positioning should have told you where he was going there. Yeah. yeah? All right, because he weren't position to the left and like we said before if you're not sure don't hold back yeah that's the only mistake shouldn't happen but it's it's a lot better a lot better that's it. steer it round off the gas now keep it very slow here off the gas right keep it slow no no keep left keep left well, you're just stay this off the gas off yeah. the gas now, what I want you to do is steer quickly to the right, quickly. Full lock it, full lock it. Uh, that's it, gas. 
gas, gas, bring catch up gently, gently, let it turn, harder. Correct your wheel. No, what I was going to do there, handbrake neutral. I thought you were going to ask me to reverse it. I was going to ask you to turn it round. But oh, three point turn. No, no, just to turn it round because we've blocked the shop. Oh yeah, but this is this. Bit of anyway. okay. Overall, that was quite good. You reckon? That was quite good. That is the best lesson. You reckon? Right. Yeah, it definitely was, in my opinion, the best lesson. Right. But please, a bit more mirror work. Yeah. Definitely. Yeah. You listening to me? Yeah, I'm just texting him to tell you about the point. Okay. A bit more mirror work. Yeah, especially your left and right mirror, exterior mirrors. Yeah. Uh, apart from that, I think everything went really well. Yeah? I was quite happy with the round of it, except the last one. No, like I said, I, I didn't panic. You did I didn't panic. panic I, did. I, I didn't panic here, and I, and I knew what was happening. But I just re I, not, I didn't react late, because I was just hoping you it did. would come. would come in fast. That's all the more reason not to go. Uh, today's lesson was good. I enjoyed it. I didn't panic at all. I don't know why, yeah, but today I just felt like just different. For any of you lot learning to drive, if you wear thicker soles, trainers, it's a bit not harder to drive, but you've got a heavier foot. So today I put on thinner trainers. You can see it feels like nothing. It's lightweight. So when I was doing all of them clutch controls, no problems. Yeah, I, I got to sort of, uh, uh, how can I say, agree with that. It was his best lesson. We've done quite well today. I was really surprised his relaxed attitude. Um, we spoke first of all in the first part of the lesson about the anticipation awareness and then we got Kieran to sort of point out situations on the road while we were actually driving, um, which he was doing and reacting very good. And then on the second part we done roundabouts and I was very pleased with his, he's nailed it today but one thing he must not forget is it's for life. Yeah. It's not just a, you know, today's lesson. And now that you've shown that you can do it, you've got to be consistent and continue this throughout the rest of your driving career. Well done, you nailed it, well done.